hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel today in this video i'm explaining about a beautiful tool which i use with whatsapp to manage my chats and achieving the inbox zero and getting the maximum productivity out of whatsapp especially the people who are using whatsapp for marketing and all day it will be very useful tool today in this video i'm explaining how to achieve inbox zero concept on whatsapp so what is inbox zero it's actually a concept introduced by merlin mann back in 2007 uh, he introduced it as the email management but in the new era emails are getting less popular compared to the whatsapp especially when it comes to the marketing and all so according to the survey conducted by havo 87 percent of the respondents said achieving inbox zero makes them feel more in control and reduce their stress levels in WhatsApp, Kubi bought the concept of Inbox Zero as more people shifted from emails to WhatsApp and it's more personal and flexible. In a survey of 2000 UK workers conducted by Mailjet, 70% of respondents reported feeling more productive after achieving Inbox Zero. So today in this video, I will be explaining how you can achieve Inbox Zero using Kubi. In order to achieve inbox zero on whatsapp we have a couple of problems facing on whatsapp like cluttered inbox inability to back up the data not designed for work so these problems are addressed by kubi for example in cluttered inbox we can how we can manage what is the solution for this we can close our cave and snooze chats and make the whatsapp inbox free from unwanted stuffs and the backup concept is basically integrating with CRMs which you usually use like Salesforce, HubSpot, Zapier. You can back up the data. You can integrate with this particular applications. And Kubi also make the WhatsApp user friendly and it will help you to chat with unsaved contacts, broadcast to a large number of audience so without wasting much time let's check what is the important features and how to install uh, this particular application click on the link in the description to download the extension and click on add to chrome this confirm add extension Just wait for a few seconds to finish the installation and add all the features in the backend to the Chrome browser. And it will automatically open the WhatsApp web once the successfully installed. Now the first thing you need to do, you can sign up for a seven day free trial or if you want to um, directly get the license just sign up with google and buy the license or you can also try for seven days and buy the license after that so now i already signed in directly and this is the window how it will look like and here on the top you can see there is a lot of features added unlike from our previous web whatsapp window all these features came along with the with our tools kubi okay fine so if you go to any of the chats you can see there is three uh, shortcuts or icons which you can use so this one to close the chats like for example you feel that this is an un unimportant chat and you don't need it just click on the close chat but it it will not disappear from the whatsapp it's still there you can see it's under the closed chats similarly you have an option to snooze the chats in case you want to refer it later after three hours if you want if it want to come back in your main inbox after three hours you can just or put this in the snooze you can also choose a custom date and time so for example i put it for three hours and the third option is archiving as you know you can archive the chats all right so let's go back 
and here you have an option to start the chats which you want to uh, mark the important chats and it will be appearing under the start chats whenever you need you can refer it but still you just understand still it will be under the main inbox now unread chats if you have any unread chats which is coming under your primary inbox it will appear here so that you don't need to scroll all the way bottom to see which chat was unread but just understand if it, if the chat is closed even if it's unread it will not appear in the inbox that is a good feature so if there if you don't want to open any chats and directly put it in closed it will not show in the unread section and you can see the snoozed chat which i have shown earlier this chat was snoozed you can unsnooze anytime and it will go back to the inbox you can also uh, add the chats to follow up or you can customize the labels like for example new clients or whatever name you need 2023 for example you have and you can add the chats to this particular um, section you can also select all and after that you can save it so you can see that new clients there is three chats has been added to the particular section all right okay now we can discuss about the template available in kobe so to access the templates you can click on the templates bar right now there is no templates you can create a template here for example i'm creating a template with test hi this is a test message and you can include variables like their display name or whatsapp name and just i create this one for testing create and you can click on this one and use the broadcast feature and send it to the uh, tab which tab you want to send say for example i want to send to all the three contacts which is available on start so click on the start and click on send so it will send the message you can just click this continue so you can see that the message is being sent hi this is a test message and after a couple of seconds with the delay it will send to the um, numbers which is available on that particular section so you can send it you can create a custom groups same like that one and send it to that broadcast message to that particular group okay now we'll discuss about the another feature uh called chatting with unknown with a non contact like for example uh, the numbers which we didn't save on our whatsapp this is a good feature say for example i will be sending to a number which is not saved name one i will delete this chat because uh, this one i used for testing now if i go to chat with non contacts just make sure you are putting the country code Say for example India, if it's US you need to plus put plus one or similarly whatever country code. After that provide the mobile number. And here also you can choose the custom tabs if you want to keep. Otherwise you can just ignore and you can send a template. Say for example the one we created or you can create a new template with a custom message. Now we am choosing test for the um test. you can also edit template before sending i don't want to edit anything so click on chat now so you can see that this template whatever i have created here it's being sent to the number which i haven't saved on my whatsapp so this is a good feature you can try and you can also import the contacts you just need to make download the sample csv file and put the mobile numbers here with the country code just make sure you put it on the number and you can put the number in the country code and format and just save it as the csv file just save in your location after that you can import the upload the csv file here and import it you can also you can see there is a lot of options here you can just enable it if you want to appear it on the screen like awaiting reply needs reply 
or anything which is customized you can put it on the index you can see this one you can also remove the section which you created or you don't wish to see in your um, dash line or whatever you call it on the top and that's about the tab settings and here you will see all the notification which is received and if there is any upcoming notification it will show up here say for example you create one um, notes or remind option or schedule an event it will appear here remind me tomorrow name test so you can see this came up under the upcoming because that will come as a notification at the specified time all right so now you can see this third section as CRM integration, which where you can integrate with Salesforce, which is one of the best CRM in the world. And you can also integrate with Zapier. You can integrate with HubSpot as well as the Google Calendar. Like for example, you can create events for a particular chat. In case you want to refer a meet, start a meeting tomorrow with the client, you can create a meeting directly from the particular chats. And choose a time, say for example, Mm, this for will leave as it is test it will add to the google calendar so that you will get the notification from the google calendar as well for the meeting and there is feature available to share the uh, chat you can choose the starting message and share it it will generate a url you can provide the chat name here create share link and it will be it can be open from anywhere in the world who has an internet access just you need to copy the share link and send it you can also share it directly via whatsapp all right so you can just upgrade the license if you wish uh, if you believe this one useful And here you can see your Kubi menu where you can see the organize the inbox integrated CRM and all. You can also request features and share with your friends, report issue and everything. Um, hope I hope you have understood most of the features. Still there are a lot of features which you can try and based on your requirement you can um, customize your inbox. So thank you for spending the time guys. Thank you for watching. Subscribe the channel. Click the bell icon for notification. Take care. Goodbye.